Happy Sunday morning, my friends. How are you? So we've got the Flampanzer wagon coming along nicely. So we've got the front MG there. It looks good, I reckon. I'll put a little photo etch gun sight on it. Didn't come out of the kit. There is one in the kit, but I've had some Academy ones that I really liked. You see, there's a lot of detail on this machine gun by Dragon. It's really, really nice. See how that all fits in together? It really goes together well. And then that'll, it's got that little puff clip. So when we put it in, we don't have to glue it together, it'll move around. But once it's in, it's in. And that was the same with this rear one here. That had the same little clip. And then you gotta glue that on and then we can put the machine gun on. I'll show you the MG, if we can find it. Let's have a look for it. Here it is. Here's the other one. As you can see, they're pretty nice. That's its little clip. Very nice. And then we've got the uh, sides on, we've got the fenders on. And we've got the interior of this done as well. So that's all painted up, which is all good. We've also got the epoxy resin in and I put the tow cable, the tow hook, straight into that so that'll be tough as nails. And we've got the dirt underneath. Now we'll do a bit of texturization under there. To get that finished off, I've got the hooks on. And then I'll texturize under there. Now I've got a lot of the bodywork completed. You see there's a little bit more sanding to go, light sanding. And I'm doing that with a very light sandpaper, so we've got a 1200. 1200, just there, a sheet of 1200, which is pretty light. And we're going for it. So we're very close to the painting stage. I'm just trying to work out how I'm going to do this back flamethrower here. You've got two photo etch pieces, a clip there and a clip that goes there. And then you wrap it around, it attaches to this. And it's got another flamethrower that it hooks on there. So I'm going to work out if I'm going to do that on or off before we paint it. So there's a lot of planning to do. Also, these are coming along very nicely. So I did one of each. I did an open and a closed one. Why not? They do look nice. Now this one's just got a little bit more to attach to it. This is the closed state one. And then they just... And they sort of go on the tank. Like so. There's a little hole in the bottom. You can never find. And then that just goes on like sort of that. It is coming along very nicely. It'll be a very nice little half tray once finished. And these guys are starting to look very good too. A lot of detail, so I've got a lot of the green going on and now I re-blacked up his top and that's going to get white on it. So he's going to have a white jacket. This fella here, he's not going to get any white jacket, so he's getting his green work. I'll, I'll redo his boots black and we'll start working on his details. His helmet will be white. A 
They're very, very nice figures. The other machine gun crew looks really difficult to build. I've been putting it off. And there's another fella I've got for this set. But I, I kept breaking his, his gun, so I'll have to fix that. They're very nice. Well, anyway, I've got to get going. And I'll speak to you again soon. Have a nice Sunday.